Okay, back again. I was wondering if you were going to show up. Oh, I'm here. I see Agrippa convinced you to run some errands. Tell me, is everything nice and clear now? One second. Such a shame. I the villain? Good and evil. Such comforting concepts, but hardly applicable. Are you so blind that you see no good in me or evil in Agrippa? Yeah, pretty much. Okay, so once he's done blabbing and this thing goes all Super Saiyan mode. Uh, you really just... There we go. How does that make you feel? I realize you doubt my intentions. Why would I take such extreme measures to save your life? Maybe I'm saving mine too. Don't care. Look at you, man. You're like 200. <laughs> That's someone else. You are ruining it. We are so close. I beg you. Nah. Nah, I'm cool. I'm tired of your just like you, Daniel, a prisoner of circumstance, trapped in a world I no longer recognize. As you gain your freedom, will you deny me mine? We are so close, closer than I've been for centuries. Oh, okay. Let me check something here real fast. Oh yeah, see right here, my give a shit is busted, so uh... Say goodnight, motherfucker. <laughs> Shadow just wants one. I think it'll settle for you. Oh, I love that beautiful music. It was my greatest triumph, and I never looked back. You think I was afraid fleeing Brennenberg? Huh. Quite the contrary. Shadow's gone. Why would you be afraid? There's nothing going to attack you. I knew it was my purgatory. Hellfire made to wash away my sins. There's no denying the things I've done. But I have paid my tribute. I gave them that awful man. I did the right thing. There you go. See, I feel like that's like the best ending. Like that's the ending that it just feels right. Right there. Ah, oh, that's good stuff. Okay, well. Thank you for joining me. This has been Amnesia, The Dark Descent. Uh, made by Frictional Games. One of the greatest indie companies ever. I am, they're my favorite indie company because most indie companies, all they make is just 2D side-scrollers, space shooters, or just the standard same things again and again. And Amnesia actually made one of the scariest games known today. And they hardly have anyone on their staff. Uh, so yeah, I, I really I love them. And I don't know why, I don't know if any of you have heard this or read this, I do not know why they sold their company, or, or the rights to Amnesia, to a different company, and they're making a new game. Right now, I am so worried for the future of Amnesia, because they sold the rights to the company that made Dear Esther. And if you've ever played Dear Esther, that's that game where literally all you do is walk and listen to a story. 
you can't even turn on your flashlight. 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 It does it for you. Uh, and all you do is literally walk. And I bought that game. I I, I watched. I, I played through it, and it was decent. They had a pretty good scenery, but it's just it really didn't feel like a game. The storyline wasn't that enticing to keep me to play it again to find out more of the storyline. It just I didn't care. Um. So, uh, uh, and so, the, this, the, this, the name of the next one, um, uh, I think it's like, something about Pig Machine or something like that, I don't, I don't remember the name exactly, uh, I'll put up the name somewhere on the screen here, uh, it's probably right there right now, um, uh, and that, just that name, in general, it's just like, oh, they're probably gonna fuck over Amnesia. If it ever comes out, it's been taking forever. So, yeah. Well, Penumbra Amnesia, amazing. I'm pretty sure the next one might not be. But, hey, at least we still have these games to play through. Uh, that was Amnesia. I am Rage Cage 20, and uh, thank you for joining me. I'll see you next time.